Okay, right. Uh, Nick, could you explain um, what you're about to do? Okay, well, I'm about to run 27 miles to Grangemouth, Scotland's oil capital. Uh, that's where most of the oil in Scotland gets refined. I'm standing here in Kepa Hill, uh, next to Springburn Cemetery, where uh, a number of uh, people are buried who fought for Scottish democracy. And today, uh, even though back then people didn't have a vote, today there are still many problems. And one of them is the fact that uh, a lot of people can't afford to heat their homes. And we've had a number of harsh winters. In 2009, 2010, the winter then, 3,000 people died in Scotland actually. And that was just because they didn't have enough money to heat their homes. Things are, to be honest, this year more desperate. The uh, price of energy for most people was up about 18% on last year. And that's going to push a lot of people into a real hardship this year. So we're going to be running to Grangemouth today, uh, Scotland's oil capital, to highlight the situation. And, you know, bring a bit of heat, if you like, onto this issue. Because, uh, it is a scandal. We are an energy producing nation and the UK government took £13 billion in taxation from, uh, from North Sea oil and gas. So that's £13 billion that could go a long way to reducing the winter dead. So we're standing here at Springburn Cemetery, hopefully to demonstrate that this doesn't need to carry on. Okay, and, and can I just... Can I just uh, confirm, you're, you're literally just about to run right now, That's all right. the way to Grangemouth. 27 miles. 27 miles. Yeah. You nervous? Uh, no. No, because <laughs> as hard as it is, it's harder for people that aren't able, you know, and can't walk great distances and are trapped in the roads. And, you know, it, this is a scandal. It, it, it needs to be changed. Okay, well, Nick Dury, I wish you the very best of luck with your run. Okay. Many thanks. <laughs> Thank I'll you. See you later. See ya.